we're now going to plant a container rose. First of all, you need your materials here. You've got your rose, which you need to pre-water and make it nice and moist before it goes into the hole. Then you can either use bone meal or top rose, and then you'll need your uh, organic farmyard manure. You can see I've prepared the hole here already, so it's a spade's width and a spade's depth. Nice and deep, perfect for it. As you can see here, the rose will fit in there perfectly. There's the spade, and then you can see that also allows enough room for the compost. We're now ready to plant the rose. So what we're going to do is to get a handful of fertilizer, like that good handful, sprinkle it round at the bottom of the hole. Just give that another little mix. I'm now going to put some farmyard manure, nice spadeful there, into the hole, mix it up. Very important this time of the year, make sure using water, again, just mix it up. Then you need to get the rose and it needs to be planted level with the crown or ideally at least an inch, maybe two inches below the soil level. If you plant it too, too high, what will happen, you can encourage suckers from the base there and that then starts rocking about, especially when it's about three or four years old. Then we're going to plant the rose. So we take it out of the pot carefully like this and then place it into the hole like that and then start back filling making sure that there's no air pockets and nice and level there and then fertilizer around the top and then finally what you then need to do is to give it a good water so you're using three quarters of a can to a can full to get this plant nicely settled in. And if you do this two or three times during the week, every week for most of the summer, that will make the roots spread out into the ground. And that's what you want. That's the most important thing, just to get the rows established. It's very important in the first year that they don't dry out. Next year, you don't need to worry about it nowhere near so much, but plenty of water during the summer months.